The 2019 LSU Tigers are widely regarded as one of the best teams in the history of college football, going a perfect 15-0 in route to a college football national championship. However, since then they have struggled and have yet to make it back to the playoffs. Our goal is to return LSU to its former glory and win the Tigers another national championship. And if I don't complete that, along with the rest of these goals, one of you guys will be winning a brand new jersey. Let's begin. Okay, here we are. The number 13 team in the country, the LSU Tigers. 86 overall, 87 offense, 86 defense. 425 defense plays in the NCC with a spread offensive scheme. Four and a half stars, team prestige. Let's go. As you can see, 2019, they won a national championship. Since then, two years where they did not win much. And then a couple of bowl wins in 22 23 with Jaden Daniels. Our goal is to win another national championship. Taking a look at the SEC, obviously it is loaded. Alabama, Texas, Georgia, Missouri, Oklahoma, Ole Miss, LSU, Tennessee, Texas A&M, all starting the season in the top 25. That means nine of the top, almost 40% of the top 25 is SEC teams. They have us projected to finish seventh in the SEC which is kind of incredible. First off, let's take a look at the roster. Obviously, the big name on this team, Will Campbell, one of the best players in college football. He's only a junior. I would be shocked if he came back for his senior season. Another impact player is left outside linebacker, Harold Perkins. He's another guy, only a junior, but he's probably gonna be gone. Opposite Will Campbell, we have Emory Jones Jr. This is a guy, we have great tackles. He's a 90 overall, he's only a junior. I could see him leaving, so he might be a guy we might have to persuade to stay. And our final impact player is junior tight end, Mason Taylor. Gonna be our best receiving threat down the field, a guy that we're probably gonna have to place going to next year. So we have a really strong team outside of them. Got a lot of 80 overall. We have Garrett Nussmeyer at the QB spot. We got a good team. I don't think we're gonna be able to compete this year. Maybe we are, I might be wrong but I'm looking to try to develop this team and probably win in year two or year three. And as I was looking at the depth chart, trying to figure out who I wanted to redshirt, someone like Weston Davis is gonna be the starter next year for Will Campbell, but I don't really know if he's gonna be ready to be an SEC caliber left tackle. So this might be a position we look to recruit heavily in the transfer portal. And then same with right tackle. We do have Emory Jones Jr. who theoretically could be back next year. Um, if he's not, we have freshman Tyree Adams. I don't really know if he's gonna be ready to contribute next year. So he might be another guy we try to recruit over and try to find someone that can start right away. Tight end, obviously Mason Taylor, um, we do have sophomores Mac Markway and Kamori Pimpton. Again, I don't really know if I trust them to contribute right away next year. We'll have to see how the development goes. So this might be another position that we try to recruit heavily in the transfer portal. And then finally, Harold Perkins Jr. He's, again, probably gone. So we're looking at Dylan Carpenter to be the guy next year. Again, I just don't really know how I feel about these guys being ready to contribute in the SEC day one. So I might try to go after the transfer portal heavy just to find stop gaps. Next up, we got to do the recruiting. Let's see what the board looks like. Okay, so we filled out our board. We're absolutely going big game hunting. I mean, we're LSU. We're one of the premier programs in the SEC. We're a top 15 team. We got to go after guys that can contribute right now. Starting... Let's take a look at wide receiver Amani Yaboa. We are going to try to go after athlete Tremaine Youssef, athlete David Vokalek, athlete Matt Boyce, right end Tyree Childress, middle linebacker Cole Spaulding, athlete Chris Cook, left outside linebacker DJ Boyce. I know he's a five-star bust. That's still a four-star talent. See if we can get him in. Maybe he can help replace Harold Perkins. Uh, wide receiver Avery Dog, wide receiver Stanley Rothe, right end Leon Holiday, right outside linebacker Matt DeLuca, left guard Steve Sermons, strong safety Ben Vallejo, Defensive tackle, Alan Denson. This is a guy that we really want, a five-star gem. This could be the crown jewel of our entire class. Next up, let's take a look at the schedule. We don't have a week zero game. We do go to USC. I know it's technically not a home game for either team. It is at Allegiant Stadium in Las Vegas. That is gonna be a super tough game. We then have a, an FCS school. I'm not exactly sure who this is supposed to be. After USC, we actually come back and host FCS Southeast. That's supposed to be Nichols State, but they're an FCS school. We then start SEC play, we go to South Carolina, we come back and we have our final two non-conference games, we host UCLA, we host South Alabama, and then we get our first bye of the season. Um, after that bye, we host number five Ole Miss, we then go to Arkansas, we go to number 24 Texas A&M, we have our final bye, and then it's home against Alabama, at Florida, at home against Vanderbilt, and at home against number 14, Oklahoma. Three of our four toughest games are at home. And the way this rebuild is gonna work, I'm gonna hop into a couple games. I think I'm gonna hop into this first game against USC just to kind of get a feel of this team and uh, hopefully start the season off on the right foot. So for this first game, I am actually gonna hop in. I think this is an important game for us to try to get a win in, start the season off strong against a ranked opponent, not necessarily on the road, but I guess it's a hell of a lot closer to LA than it is to Baton Rouge. So let's get started. We're gonna start in the first quarter, tie game. USC is driving. We got, oh, Oh, it was a handoff. Whoa, I thought it was a run. Oh, shit. Third and six. Damn. I got it psyched out there. That was my fault, 100%. I'm going to go sit. 
on Alexander out here. Ooh, cut back across my face. Hmm. Okay, 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 okay. <sighs> USC's good. USC's good. They do come out in that same defense, sending Lacey on a streak, and then Thomas on a post. Be oh, it's cover high. It's single high, which means that's going to be wide open. Oh, my God. Nussmeyer, you can't miss that ball. I read that perfectly. They're in they look like they're in quarters. They are holding outside leverage. Lacey should be open. <sighs> Running back was wide open across, or whoever that drag route was wide open. I'm gonna flip it. I think I can get jet touch pass to the wide side of the field. See if we can get Thomas in open space. I know it's third and 23. You're probably not gonna get this, but. Oh, who fucking receiver has to hold that corner? Forced to punt them the ball back. Dude, goddamn, our gunners are getting cooked. Who is that? Holy shit, we need a new special teams guy. Holy fuck, that gunner was getting just bullied. In the red zone, let's see if we can hit him with an RPO. Uh, the read man is Taylor if he comes down. Stay in bounds! Oh my god, why? Everything that can go wrong is going wrong right now. This is just brutal. Third man, this is a man, yeah. Get there, touchdown. Okay, we cut the lead to seven. Just gotta help our defense can hold up. If we could hold them here to a field goal, that would be huge. First and 10, 13 yard line. Get him, there we go. Second and nine. I'm on Penn here. Whoa, perfect, perfect, great defense. I was looking for that drag coming back. I, I'm gonna sit on the safety, I'm gonna sit on Allen back here, I'm gonna come down. Eight, dude, we can't, we cannot stop USC's offense. Mon Alexander, we need to hold no field goal. Oh, whoa, whoopsies, I meant to pop him, but I accidentally hit start. Okay, fourth and seven, they're gonna get a field goal out of it. We scored very quickly. Dude, get off your block, get off your block, shut up, blocks, four yards on that is crazy. Here we go, I wanna get out of safety. Oh no, I wanted to, Get there, huge sack! Second and 13, I'm gonna let him take it to the two minute warning, see if I can keep all my timeouts. I'm gonna send some heat, he probably run, they probably run this ball, but I'm gonna sit on Allen. Golly, he got 10 yards on that timeout. Okay, down three, we just need a field goal to send this game to overtime. Here we go, we're gonna get the ball with just under two minutes to go. We just need a field goal for overtime. Give me a good kick return. Oh, okay, that's not bad. We're at the 40. We just need probably 30 or so yards to get a field goal. I'm gonna put Taylor on an out route. Get over his head. Yep, okay. Whew, good ball. Good ball, Garrett Nussmeyer. Not gonna lie, I was a little nervous with that one. I think Lacey is gonna be open. Oh my God, that was a terrible ball. Garrett Nussmeyer, man, what are we doing? Put on a drag. He didn't hold on. Oh yeah, was he, oh wait, was he out of bounds? Is that what they said he was? I think he got his feet in. This would be a huge, oh, they did, they gave it to us. That's huge. I'm just not making the right reads. Just not making the right reads. I think we have, oh, they're inside leverage. I think we're gonna hit Lacey across the middle. I have no idea what the read is. The read is take off. The read is take off, Garrett Nussmeyer. Holy shit. Here we go, just over a minute to go. He's gonna break on that ball. Here we go, there we go, there we go. I'm gonna put Daniels on a speed out and I'm gonna put Thomas on a corner instead of that crosser. I think that's gonna force that outside linebacker, that safety, whoever that is to make a decision. And whoever he doesn't cover, yeah. yeah whoever Every doesn't cover was gonna be wide open. Here we go. They're in outside, which means late other oh, man. I'm gonna take off. I'm gonna take off. I'm gonna take off. I'm gonna take off. Give me a block. Give me a block. Okay, I guess I'm just gonna take off. Oh my god, go! Who the fuck is that receiver, bro? Go, go take off. Go give me a fucking block. Golly. Hey, I can't throw the ball today. I can't throw the ball. I'm taking off. Cut back. Oh, second and goal. I know I have a timeout left. I wanna try to kill this clock. Taylor on a drag. I almost want Lacey on an out here. Yep, touchdown. Let's go! And the LSU Tigers take a four point lead with just under 15 seconds to go. Kyron, Lacey, they need a touchdown with 12 seconds. I'm just gonna sit back. There's no point in bringing pressure. Four man rush, <sighs> give me that. Oh! Second and 10, nine seconds to go. I think we're gonna make things uncomfortable. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna bring some heat. I'm gonna sit on Allen over the top, make him beat me. Oh shit, okay. That was a really good throw. I lied, I'm going to sit back. I'm not bringing nothing. Sitting on a linebacker and I'm bringing Penn back. Hail Mary, that's the out route. Yep, don't care. I literally manually had to go cover that. Oh no. That's DPI. Oh my God, it's DPI in the end zone. Oh, it's only on the 41. One final untimed down. I'm sitting on, oh, I'm dude, fuck that. I'm getting on a, a D lineman. I don't even care. Oh, it's out of bounds. Perfect. And we survive. The LSU Tigers head to Allegiant Stadium and take down USC to start the season 1-0. CJ Daniels, eight catches, 266 yards with three touchdowns, and absolute Daniels detonation.
here in Vegas. With that win, our championship contender and brand exposure jump up to an A+. Plus. That is huge for us. Harold Perkins, a five tackle game is the SEC Defensive Player of the Week. I'll be honest, that seems kind of low for SEC Defensive Player of the Week. Now this, 266 yards, three touchdowns. Now that is an Offensive Player of the Week. With that win, we move up to number 10 in the country. Our next game is against FCS Southeast. This should be a cakewalk. And for Harold Perkins, it was actually a seven tackle, one sack game. And CJ Daniels, 266 yards, three touchdowns. An absolute Daniels detonation. And with this game being against an FCS school, I'm going to assume this. We should have no problem taking them down. And even though we do win, we jump up to number eight in the country. Our championship contender actually goes down, and so does our brand exposure. I really don't understand how that works. Garrett Nussmeyer wins the ICC Offense Player of the Week, throwing six touchdowns. Absolute masterclass by Nussmeyer. And he wins National Offensive Player of the Week. That is great for Garrett. 28 for 34, almost 400 passing yards, six passing touchdowns, and a rushing touchdown. Like I said, an absolutely great game. Also, Octavius Oxidine, that's a sick name. Our first SEC game is on the road against South Carolina. This is a game I think we should be able to sim. We should be pretty fine taking them down. And we lose. So we actually fall to 2-1. We're number 19 in the country. South Carolina takes us down. Let's take a look at this game. Kind of got smoked. I'm not going to lie. Garrett Nussmeyer played fine. Ran the ball okay defensively. We just got cooked. Next up, we host UCLA. This is a game I think we should be fine to sim. I don't really see them causing us any problems. They're coming to our building. We got to be able to bounce back. We get our first commit of the video, right end Tyree Childress. Hopefully that means we won this game. It means we did. We jump up to number 17 in the country, three and one. Do have some guys at risk of transfer. Emery Jones is one of them. That is not someone we want to lose. We are starting to have guys lock us out, so we're going to have to start filling guys. I'm going to put Marvin Mastrid back on the board. He's a five-star defensive tackle. He's a guy that most teams aren't going after. Let's see if we can kind of sneak in late and get him. Next up is our final non-conference game against South Alabama. This is the game, another game I think we should be able to sweep through. I am going to sim through this one. If we lose to South Alabama at home, we got bigger issues. We get another commit in right end, Leon Holiday. Left outside linebacker, DJ Boyce. So we're slowly starting to trickle in commits. We have a lot of guys on the defensive side of the ball coming in. We lose to South Alabama. Our championship contender fall all the way down to an A minus. Bro, what the fuck just happened? How did we just lose to South Alabama? We do have some big injuries. I'm taking a look at it at the bye. Harold Perkins has an upper arm fracture. He will be back by the time we play our next game, but freshman Deshaun Womack will not. We're going to have to have a backup in at right end, and we're actually going to move senior Savion Jones from left end to right end. He's going to be the starter there. We're really thin at these line positions. I'm glad we're recruiting well there. We get five star right outside linebacker Matt DeLuca. We did get five star middle linebacker Cole Spaulding. Five star center. Chris Cook. We're recruiting well. We just need to start winning more. This game against Ole Miss is huge. Not only is it a rival game and having a winning record versus our rivals is one of our goals. We really need to get our season back on track. And if we can take down Ole Miss, I think that'd be the perfect game. Here we go. We're going to start off on the 25. We get the ball first. If we can come down the field and score, that'd be huge. What a ball by Garrett Nussmeyer. And I'm going to score on the first play. That is going to get the Tiger fans rocking. Let's go. Third and five. Tiger Stadium is going ballistic right now. If we can hold him here, that'd be huge. Ooh, ooh, damn, he was wide open. Gonna send some heat. Can't let Jackson Dart get comfortable. I'm gonna go hit on. I'm gonna go hide in the safety because I can't cover shit, man. <sighs> Wow, that was a really good throw. Okay, well, this is why they're the number 13 team in the country. This is not going to be easy. I think if I send Taylor on a streak, it'll, it might get there. Get there. Oh, we got to hold on to that. I'm going to put Lacey on a slant and Taylor on a drag. I think one of these gets open. Cut across the middle. First down. Mason Taylor, absolute animal. Let's see if we can. I'm going to put Thomas on a drag and Hilton. Actually, they're outside leverage. I'm sending Lacey on a speed out. Oh, no, they're not. Take off. Garrett Nussmeyer. No. Oh, my God. Holy shit. I thought I fucked that up. Witching to cover three. I did not want to get stuck on a D lineman. That's not where I want to get stuck. I'm going to sit back. May Jackson Dart beat me. Dude, I keep getting stuck on fucking D lineman. That's where I want to be. Do they run it? Second goal at the two. Just under a minute to go. They hand this ball off. Yep. Blew it up. I read it. I knew it. Huge stop. We just need one more. We'll force him to a field goal. I'm going to bring some pressure. I cannot let them get comfortable. I'm going to sit on Allen. I'm coming down. Oh, get there. Get there. Oh, yeah, I let the CPU tag out. I was not about to try to hold that myself. We're going to call timeout. We're going to call timeout. They're going to keep their field goal. If we can get the ball back with like 30 seconds to go, we might be able to get into field goal range and extend it to a seven point lead. Fucked it up. But he pinned it. He missed it. Oh my God. He missed it. going to put Thomas on and out. And honestly, I'm going to put Taylor on and out too. Let's see if we can get one of these open. Yep. There was the blitz. Oh my God, that ball took forever to get there. Let's see if we can hit a 50 yard field goal. I mean me, because this is going to be fun. Pinned it. Oh my God, I 
fucking nailed it. Woo! And if we can get this onside kick, we can take down Ole Miss. This would be huge. This would be huge, and we're going to do it. We're going to take down Ole Miss in our building. That is a huge win. We not only take down Ole Miss, we win the Magnolia Bowl, move to 1-0 against our rivals. This was a huge win for our team. We absolutely needed this to get back on track. Great game from Garrett, 250 with three touchdowns. We absolutely needed it from Nussmeyer. That highlight is hilarious, by the way. And with that win, we jump back into the top 25 at number 23. Our championship contender moves back to an A as well. We love to see that. Five-star athlete Tremaine Youssef commits to Texas. We're going to take him off our board. As well as five-star wide receiver Avery Dog. This game against Arkansas is super important. One, because we want to continue to win. But two, because it's a rivalry game. It's the battle for the golden boot. If we can win this, we can move to a commanding 2-0 in rivalry games. We're going to let the CPU handle it. We hopped into a couple games already. Don't want to make it too unfair. We get five-star center Matt Boyce to commit. That's a huge commit for our program. But let's see if we win the game. And we do. So we move to number 18 in the country. Our championship contender jumps up to A+. And we move to a 2-0 record against rival. And against Arkansas, Garrett Nussmeyer had 388 passing yards, four touchdowns, 26 on the ground with another touchdown. He was the SEC Offensive Player of the Week. An absolutely great game from Garrett. Next up, we have to go on the road to take on Rival number seven, Texas A&M. We're going to hop into this game. This is going to probably be the toughest game we play, not because I think they're the toughest team, but because it's the only time we play a ranked game on the road. We're going to switch things up. We're going to go with the whiteout. If we can do this, we can move to 3-0 in rivalry games. That would be huge. And we can get a signature win on the road and potentially push ourselves back into the conversation for the SEC championship and potentially even a playoff spot. Kyle Field is going to be absolutely rocking for this game. Let's see if we can come out with the dub. What the fuck are they doing? Start off on defense. This is not looking good. Not a good start. Gonna be a run. See if I can blow it up manually. Okay. Whew. Got inside. I'm gonna bring the heat this time for real. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Okay. Whew. Third and goal. Don't think they run this ball. I'm gonna sit in cover four. See if I can. Oh my god, we got cooked. Whoa. They strike first. Strike first. We knew this game was not gonna be easy. Third and nine. I'm gonna set some heat. I cannot let Connor Wheaton get comfortable back there. I'm gonna sit on Major Burns. Oh no, what the hell? What the, that safety. Oh my god, that corner didn't even. We are down 21. We absolutely have to get a touchdown out of this drive. Can't make a fucking audible? I can't make a how route right now? I can't call an audible right now. And the clock is ticking. Okay, I just gotta fucking make call this play then. Gotta send some. Get it out. Come back. Oh, they sent some major heat. Holy. Whew. Garrett Nussmeyer stood in there and got popped. Let's see if that corner route is gonna be open. No, it's not. <sighs> Dude, oh my god, I'm so rattled right now. It's ridiculously rattled right now. I'm not gonna lie. Turn cover one. Behind the back. There we go. There we go! Okay. Okay. We finally score. Our defense made a huge play. We have the ball back. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, fuck. I, I sent the wrong audible. Let's go! And just like that, we cut the lead to seven. So at half, we're down seven, but we started off down 21. So this is huge. We had a great second quarter. Let's see if we can get a big kick return here. This would be massive. Stay on your feet. Uh, I kind of fucked it up. I didn't, I didn't see a lane. Okay. I think Hilton is my read here. Get there. What a ball by Garrett Nussmeyer. I couldn't make any audibles. I had to deal with the play that I picked. Five man rush. Stay on your feet, Garrett Nussmeyer. Dive. Oh my God. Let's go. Third man outside. Yeah, I shouldn't have taken that hit. Third and third and second goal. Playing in Kyle Field has been a nightmare. Touchdown. Let's go! And we tie the game at 21 apiece. Let's go! I'm gonna bring some heat. First and 10, our defense is struggling right now. I'm gonna sit on weeks on the running back. Oh, I got I kind of made it took a bad angle, but they didn't they didn't get anything. 14 rushes for eight yards. Our defense is going crazy. I'm gonna send some more heat. I'm gonna sit back on the safety this time. I'm gonna sit back on Allen, sit in the zone. I think they run this ball. Yeah, they do. Excellent job by our defense. Let's go. Third and 14. I'm not gonna bring any pressure. I'm gonna sit back. There we go. There we go. There we go. Okay. Fourth and six. They're gonna get their field goal. Don't run into him. Don't run into him. Okay. Whew. Down three with three minutes to go. Kyle Field is is rocking right now. This is gonna be tough to try to win. And they're just gonna give me that. They're just gonna keep giving me this. Oh my god. Let's go, Garrett Nussmeyer. They're gonna keep giving me running. Lanes. I think Hilt, if they're in single high, I think Hilt is my read. They're not there. And I probably could have ran it for farther and had those two downfield blocks, but take off, take off, take off, take off, take off. Oh my god. I'm I'm literally just letting the receivers run and then running with Garrett Nussmeyer. I think I might have Lacey on a go ball. I can't do audibles to certain receivers. Okay, well then fuck it. I do. I have Lacey on a go ball. Get there. Get there. Get there. Get there. Get there. Get there. What a throw by Garrett Nussmeyer. Let's go. I'm going to bring some heat. I do not want Connor Wigman to get comfortable. I'm going to sit on Penn in this zone. He is hurt. Oh, it's a screen. Oh, I missed. Oh my God. It's keeping him in bounds. Oh my God. Okay. 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 No first down. We get to the two minute warning. They need a touchdown. I feel comfortable sitting back for now. I might have to bring some pressure in a second. I'm going to bring Major Burns down here. Oh, good job. Good job getting back to that ball. Like I said, I'm just going to sit back second and 10. I'm going to sit on Penn. He's, man, he's hurt, so 
the CPU is gonna, oh, it's a run. Oh, it's a play action. Oh. Shit. Okay, time out. They still have two remaining. I'm gonna bring some pressure. I haven't done it all drive. Bad. I'm gonna go sit on Allen. Here we go. <sighs> He's hurt, but he caught that ball. Oh my god, and they get a free timeout out of it. Are you fucking kidding me? He's faking it. It's bullshit. I'm gonna move Penn over manually. Okay, there we go. Second and eight. The ball stays inbounds too. I'm gonna bring some heat. That's I know where he's going. He should go right there. Yep. Let's go! We got the sack! I'm gonna bring pressure again. Third and eighteen. They still have two timeouts left, but they need they need to score a touchdown. There's no field goal for this. They have to score a touchdown here to win this game. Sitting on the back. Popped him fourth and two. I'm gonna get some pressure on Weedman. <sighs> this is huge. This is the game. We don't if we stop him here, this is the game. I might bring Penn down. I think they might run this. Nope. He popped it out! Let's go! One first down, and we come into College Station and win this game. Let's see if we can pull it out. I haven't ran the ball much. Stay in bounds. We got four. Huge. We got four on that. Let's go, Williams. Give me a good push up front. Give me a good push up front! Let's go! And the LSU Tigers are gonna come into Kyle Field and take down Texas A&M. What a game! Went on a 28-3 win to come into College Station and take down rival Texas A&M. And with that game, we move up to number 14 in the country. Three and one on the SEC third right now. Harold Perkins, the SEC Defensive Player of the Week with three tackles. I'm sure there's some stats in there that aren't being shown. Let's take a look. Top 25, the first college football top 25, and we are just outside the top 13. Again, sitting at number 14, we ideally get to the top 10, get an auto bid, but right now Texas A&M, we have the head-to-head -head with them. And then Georgia and Alabama, we do not play Georgia this year. We do play Alabama. That is going to be the most incredible important game of our entire season. And like I said, Harold Perkins had four tackles, but he also had a forced fumble and two fumble recoveries. A massive game. A perfect game from Perkins. A huge game from Harold. Going into our final bye week, we do have some major injuries. Xavion Thomas has a quad tear. He'll be out for the next three weeks. I believe that puts him out for almost the rest of the regular season. And Javion Tavanio, he has a partial PCL tear. He's out for five weeks. He is definitely out for the rest of the regular season. Assuming we make the playoffs and or a bowl game, he should be back for that. We move all the way up to number 10 in the country. Six and two, but this game is the biggest game of the season. Number one, Alabama comes to Death Valley and it's a rivalry game. Right now we're 3-0 against our rivals. And looking at our schedule, we have one more game against Florida that's considered a rivalry. So no matter what this season, even if we lose the next two, we're gonna go three and two in our rivalry games. We have a real shot at the playoff. We need to take down Alabama. And then after that, we have to go to Florida, host Vanderbilt and host Oklahoma. But this game could really put us into the national championship conversation. This game against Alabama, the game of the week, this might be the game of the year. Two top 10 teams. Alabama comes to Death Valley. They are undefeated. This would put us at the front of the SEC championship conversation and thrust us squarely in the limelight for a national championship. We're going to change it up a little bit. We're going to go with the purple uppers and the white pan. All right, here we go, boys. Welcome to Death Valley. I haven't really brought out the cheese much. Let's see if we can hit him with a nice jet touch pass. I ran that a little bad. Kind of my fault, but not the worst. Could have been worse. I saw it. I, I, I should have hit RB right away. Mason Taylor is open here. If they're in cover two. Yep. What a catch by Mason Taylor. Let's put the ball on the ground. We haven't done it yet. Did we can get a nice pull block here. He is... Yeah. I tried to put the ball on the ground. Second and nine. I'm gonna put Samson on it out really quick. I think Lacey is open right there. Yep. I gotta read that faster. I gotta read that faster, but there we go. First and 10. Garrett Nussmeyer has had a great season so far. I've been really happy with his development. I think Daniel's on an out might be okay here. They're in cover two, which means Samson's route is a waste. But if I put Samson on a post here, that might open things up. Actually, in quarters. I gotta read that way faster. He's open. That's a, that's an open route. I'm gonna drag Mason Taylor. I think Hilton is gonna be open right away. Yeah. Cut up field. Cut up field. Give me a block. Give me a block! Let's go! Stay on your feet! Stay on your foe! Oh my god. I think Lacey, I might have to hit him quick. Oh, they didn't bring anything. They didn't bring anything. They only brought three guys. I'm taking off. Garrett Nussmeyer! Rushing touchdown! We take a 7-0 lead on the tide. First and goal at the 9. I'm not... I can't let Jalen Milrow get any... I can't let him get comfortable. I'm on a D-lineman. <sighs> Give me that! Let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Let's get past the 20. Oh, can I get a pick 6? No, I can't. Let's go! Second and 7. Alabama is threatening. I just need to keep them out of the end zone. I sit on Penn. It's, oh my... Gosh, Justice Haynes is running all over us. I'm gonna sit back. Tiger Field is absolutely rocking right now. I'm gonna sit on Weeks here. Let's, what? What the fuck was that? How the fuck does that even happen? I'm coming down with Weeks to run. Yeah, bad pursuit angles. The counter got me. Set a double slant, so I'm gonna put Hilton on an out route. That's where the blitz was from. Let's go, first down. I'm gonna send some heat. Alabama's defense, Alabama's offense has, oh fuck, I got stuck on it. Oh shit, what? Dude, I, it just rubs off me. Pause, no pause. I'm on Penn, I'm sitting on this slot receiver. Oh, I'm not sitting on that though. Get him out of bounds. First and goal at the two. He probably runs this. It's just in case I'm sitting in the back. I'm going to bring Penn manually. Oh, we cut back. Push him forward. There we go. We need to stop here. I'm coming down with weeks. Oh, I took a such a bad angle. Oh my God. I read it like a book. Okay. I'm going to put Mason Taylor on an, a direct out here. I think depending on how they out. Yeah, that's the read. 
Okay, nice six yard out. I want to come back across the middle, but they're guarding it pretty heavy. Hilton, Tay. I'm going to send Hilton on a... Oh, fuck. No, I didn't. Get there. Mason Taylor, you are an animal. That was a great catch. In single high, which means... That was not the read. Hmm. Sling it to Mason. Get out of bounds. I just need to get some points out of this drive. That's all I need. I'm going to put Williams on a post. I think that corner might be open late. No, I let him way too far. Garrett Nussmeyer. I'm not putting this ball. I'm going to get this out of 50, bro. Hilton, I just need one yard out of you, big dog. Just need one yard. I'll take more, though. Whoop. I'll take more. Let's go. Oh, he got back up. I know I have three timeouts. What a ball, Garrett Nussmeyer. Timeout. I got two timeouts left. So if I get sacked, I still have one. I called the wrong fucking play. This is what I wanted. Here we go. Actually, drag. I think Daniels is open. Switching the post. Tilton's open. This is a touchdown. Okay, I'm taking my three. Those are some bad balls, but I'm taking my three. Holy shit. Mon Allen. Oh, it's a design quarterback run. No! Here we go. Get there, Nussmeyer. What a throw by Garrett Nussmeyer. Get out of there! Get out of there, Hilton! Let's go! First and goal at the four. I haven't really leaned on Williams at all. This is the time to do it. With the game on the let's go! Tie game! And our offense has been humming. We're gonna put Hilton on a corner. I think that's the... Over the linebacker. Oh, I thought I'd get it over him. I think Lacey might be open late on this. That's my look. Oh, they're bringing heat. I don't have time. Shit. I couldn't. I didn't have time to read on the field. I knew I was going to get drilled. Let's try a screen. We haven't run one of these yet. They're in man. I think Daniels is my read here. That was just, okay. Drilled it. Okay. We go up 10 just before the fourth quarter. Here we go. Alabama has all three timeouts. We are up by three. A first down wins the game. We got to bring out the cheese. Got to bring out the cheese. Cut back. Cut back. It's a foot race. Hilton. Down the, get there, stay on your feet, let's go, oh my god, and we're gonna take down the number one team in the country, let's go, and we take down the Crimson Tide, that was a huge game for this team, I still don't understand, I mean I kind of helped by beating Alabama myself manually, but we lost to Southern Alabama in the sim. That's crazy to me. We do have 10 coach points. Let's go use these now. And with that win, we move all the way up to number five in the country. We're threatening for a first round bye. That would be huge. We're actually, five-star Amani Yaboa actually commits to Alabama. So we're going to take him off our board. And then five-star David Vakolak, he commits to Georgia. So we're going to take him off our board. Five-star guard Steve Sermons commits to Texas. We're going to take him off the board. Our next game is against rival Florida. I'm not going to hop into this one. I've hopped into probably one too many, if we're being honest. If we win this, we'll go to a perfect five and oh against our rivals this year. And this this is our final game on the road. This is going to be a really tough game. A lot tougher than people realize based on just the record. We did get another five-star commitment from defensive tackle Marvin Mastrude. That's huge. And we take down Florida on the road. We actually fall to number six, but we stay at eight and two. That's perfect. Our next game is against Vanderbilt. This is a game we should run away with. We move to nine and two. Our stadium atmosphere moves back up to an A+. We are number six in the country. Our final game of the season is against Oklahoma. They're fighting for bowl eligibility. We're fighting for a shot in the SEC championship. Take a look at the conference standings. Right now, we're number one tied with Alabama. However, a loss will put us at six and two. I don't know if we have the tiebreaker with Kentucky. We already clinched for the SEC championship game because we didn't play Kentucky. And we already have the head-to-head -head against Alabama. Those are the only other two teams that have a chance to make it in. Right now, this game is super important because it allows us, if we were to make the SEC Championship game and lose, we still have a buffer in terms of making the college football playoff. And we lose the final game of the regular season to Oklahoma by 10. Number 23, Oklahoma is 6-6. Six and six. That is an insane SEC buy. Garrett Nussmeyer went for five touchdowns. The problem is we didn't really run the ball and our defense was fucking god off. Because of that loss, Stanley Rothay actually commits to Oregon, so we're going to take him off our board. With that loss, we fall to number 12. We have a shot at a top four seed if we win the SEC championship game. Although we somehow didn't make the conference championship, even though we went six and two. Oh, Alabama went seven and one. They were the one we had the head to head with. Oh my God. So our destiny is completely in the hands of other teams. So we want a Kansas State win. We definitely want a North Texas win. We want a Miami win. Those are the ones that matter. We really, actually, honestly, we want a Jacksonville State win, a Kansas State win, a North Texas win, Alabama, Miami. That's the big one. And the Big Ten doesn't Matter. They're both gonna make it. We really might not make the playoff. That's fucking crazy. Did we make the college football playoff? We move up to number nine. Jackson Dart wins the Heisman. We beat him. Fraud. And we're taking on Florida State in the first round of the college football playoffs. We got 10 more points just in case this goes another year. I put my coach points to take less time to fully scout guys. I think that's super important. Did we have a Heisman finalist? We did not. Said it went to Jackson Dart, but Jalen Milrow is number one. Chandler Morris, former TCU quarterback at three. Tro Troy Stellato and KJ Jefferson who is former Arkansas quarterback. Okay, so we didn't have a Heisman finalist. So even if we do win this year, we didn't complete the SEC championship goal and we didn't complete the Heisman finalist goal. So even if we win the championship, I still have to give a jersey away to one of you guys. So that would be great for you guys. Taking a look at early national signing day, we were able to bring in five-star athlete Matt Boyce. 
right end Tyree Childress, middle linebacker Cole Spaulding, defensive tackle Marvin Mastrude, athlete Chris Cook, left outside linebacker DJ Boyce, right end Leon Holiday, right outside linebacker, and right outside linebacker Matt DeLuca. I obviously brought in a bunch of other guys. Really happy with the way this class turned out. So our first playoff game is against number six, Florida State. And this one's gonna be in Doak Walker Stadium. This is going to be probably the toughest environment we walk into all season. Because of that, we're gonna switch it up. We're gonna make some custom unis. We're gonna go purple jersey with the whiteout pants and the helmet. Gotta bring out something special for this game. All right, here we go. First down. We're gonna start off with the ball on the ground. Let's try to establish the run game. It's gonna be tough. That, ooh, wow. Someone came off the edge quick. We're gonna try it again. We're gonna see if we can establish the run. They only have four down linemen this time. See if we can get upfield. Okay, we got we got four there. Much better run. Holy shit, trying to call an audible right now is not working. There we go. Okay, go Grant Nussmeyer. Right across the middle. Oh, I didn't think that linebacker would fade off. Okay, okay so we got to punt the ball. Oh my god, he... Oh, I couldn't have gotten a... Popped him. There we go. I thought I was going to get a roughing the punter call. That would have been huge. If we can get a stop here, that'd be huge. I'm going to fly back on Penn. Yeah, okay, so they got a first down. DJU. Third and 12, I'm going to send some heat. I'm going to try to bring... I'm going to try to bring some heat. Not. I can't let DJU get comfortable. <sighs> Absolutely cooked that fucking corner. I'm gonna sit on Penn here. I'm gonna sit back. Popped him. There we go. I'm gonna keep sitting back if they wanna run. I'm gonna let him come down and manually cover it with weeks. Knew it. I read the. Oh, I didn't. Oh, he shouldn't have cut back. Okay. I run that jet touch pass all the time. I know what that call looks like. Like I said, I'm gonna sit back. I'm gonna let. They're probably gonna run this ball here. I'm gonna come down manually with Penn. There we go. Huge sack from Savion Jones. All right. If we can hold him to a field goal, that'd be huge. Just keep him there. If we hold him to a field goal, they take a 3 0 lead. Big third down, 30 to 12. We absolutely need this to. We absolutely need to stop. That's fine. Keep everything in front of us. Fourth and nine. It's the playoffs, man. We're on the road. We're gonna bring out the cheese. We got the jet touch pass. We just need three yards. This is the money play. Yep. Get to the edge. That was a terrible block by fucking Will. Williams. Golly. I'm glad I cut it in though. Reed is that corner. If someone flies out to Taylor, it's a run. If not, I'm throwing it to Taylor. Don't cut up field. Oh my God. Stay outside. But Hilton on a drag. Oh yeah. Holy. I just tried to not take a sack. Listen, like I said, it's the playoffs. Maybe I'm a jet touch pass merchant. I don't care. I'm trying to win. Touchdown. Let's go. We take a four point lead early in the first half. If we get this onside kick, the game is over. No, 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 no way, bro. What the fuck? Gonna send some heat. I do not want DJU to get comfortable. I'm gonna sit on Major Burns and oh shit. Gonna sit on Major Burns, gonna send some heat. Perfect. And that's the game, folks. LSU is gonna come into Doak Walker, take down Florida State in advance to the quarterfinals. I'm sorry I didn't show you guys as much of that game. I'll be honest, the game was really not that close. They couldn't do anything until all of a sudden in the fourth, they made a really big run and then chewing the clock and they made up a lot of ground, but the game was really never in question. They scored 20 of their 26 points in that fourth quarter. I mean, that, you saw it. Garrett with a great game, 152, but had four touchdowns. And with that playoff game win, we advanced to the quarterfinals. I don't know who our opponent will be. Let's take a look at the bracket and let's see who the potential opponents are. We are LSU, which means we're gonna take on Kansas State. The other games in this bracket, uh, A&M versus North Texas in the 8-9. Battle of Texas for the right to play Oregon. Michigan UAB for the right to play Boston College. Colorado Ole Miss for Alabama. And then obviously we beat Florida State to take on Kansas State. Harold Perkins with four tackles, the SEC Defensive Player of the Week. I'm sure that's not, mi that's missing some sacks or something. Here we go. Our semifinal game is against Alabama. We've already played this team once before. We hosted them, beat them by 10. Really wasn't as close as the score indicates. Can we do it again? That is the question. We're gonna change up the uniforms. We're gonna go with the, we're gonna go with the white helmet, white jerseys, yellow pants. Let's do a little something crazy. Offense went down, started us off. We got a field goal out of the first drive. Not crazy, not bad. At least we got some points on the board. First and 10 at the 15. Alabama is driving. Gonna send some heat. Sitting on Penn. I'm gonna replace that safety. There we go. Absolutely huge. Nice job, Lee. Gonna sit back this time. Second and 14. They are in. Three men in the backfield. I'm gonna fly. Oh, oh good fake. Oh, we got there. Harold Perkins with a sack. The playmaker. I mean, third and 21. I'm just gonna sit back. If they get a field goal, they get a field goal. I'll be okay with that. Oh, it's a screen. I didn't even realize it. Nice job. Fourth and 18. Okay, so we're gonna hold no field goal. All right, so defense held strong. Tie game. Here we go. Third and four. Get there. Yeah, I gotta have quick stuff because their D-line flies. Here we go. Third and seven. I'm gonna send Lacey on a streak and Thomas on an out. I think that is gonna get... No, it's not. I gotta take off. Dude. Ah, Texas route. I should have seen it. 48-yard field goal. Do we get it? Just inside the upright. Let's go. And our offense is marching. Let's see if we can sneak one in on the goal line. Have not run the ball much. Let's see if we can do it now. Meet him in the hole. Oh, we got a yard. Hold if I want to keep. Okay. Oh, shit. I forgot that I was supposed to let... Dude. The read option, I'm sorry, switching the fucking read option play call is such some of the stupidest fucking things I've ever seen. I'm sorry, yay. Everything else this game isn't great. Switching the read option makes no sense to me. Daniels is open for a touchdown here. Whoop! There we go. There we go. Take a 10-point lead. Just like that, Alabama strikes back. Put Thomas on an out. Yeah, that's gonna be open. Bad ball. Timeout. Depending on where that, that linebacker goes, Thomas might be open right away. They brought him to blitz. Oh, huge. Stay on your feet! Get out of there! Stick work! Oh my goodness! Thomas! 
All the way to the five. What a run. Javion Thomas with an incredible play. I'm going to put Pimpton on an out here. I think he might be my read. Get the ball into his hands. Let's go. And we take a 10 point lead just before the half. Third and seven. We're in field goal range. I'm going to put Thomas on an out. And I'm going to put Daniels on a corner. Actually, I don't like that. I actually should have done Daniels on a corner and Thomas on an out. Yeah, there we go. Get there. Beautiful ball, Garrett Nussmeyer. First and 10. I'm going to put Lasty on a streak. I think I can zip it. Yep, he's impressed. Oh. Daniels. Daniels on a drag. Thomas on a corner. Taylor on. Actually, I'm going to keep Taylor up. Oh my God, bad ball. Our defense held strong. They blitzed a mean outside linebacker, and I had, I just panicked. I knew I was going to get sacked. Going to send Lacey on a streak. Hopefully, clears that DB. Thomas should be open across the middle. Right. Oh, never mind. Hit the underneath. Hit the underneath. There we go. Hilton. Garrett Nussmeyer's had a great game. That pick was my fault. We go with the jet touch pass a lot. Let's see if we can fake it and go back underneath to Jackson on an inside zone. Oh my God. My my offensive line is getting I, 11 rushes for 11 yards. You guys wonder why I pass the ball so much? That's why. Fucking cook. Hold on outside release. I got to I got to attack across the middle of the field. Taylor on a corner. I'm going to switch that route. Right across his face. Hold on to it. Hold on to it. Go forward. Oh my God. Scoring against the Alabama defense is like pulling fucking teeth. I'm sending Daniels on it. I'm going to put Lacey on a speed out and Pimpton on a speed out. It should drag. Actually, I'm going to put Lacey on a corner. Oh, no. speed out. I lied. That should open up the thing for Pimpton. No. Right after we took a 10 point lead, we absolutely fucking annihilated Alabama. 17 unanswered in the fourth quarter. They didn't score in the second half. Didn't miss much outside the celebration. We had two picks on Jalen Milrow. Garrett, we had the one pick that I hope you guys saw. That was me. Through four touchdowns. I'm um, an absolute masterclass from Garrett. And yeah, so he had SEC Offensive Player of the Week. Again, 338 yards, four touchdowns. And we're going against Oregon. Let's take a look at the bracket. Um, we can review the whole thing. Obviously, on our side, LSU, we take down, we upset Florida State. We then upset Kansas State, and we upset Alabama. We're in the national championship. On the bottom side, obviously, Colorado beat Ole Miss. Alabama beat them. They lose to us. Top left, North Texas actually takes down Texas A&M. They lose to Oregon. Oregon then beats Michigan. Michigan beat UAB. Upset Boston College, lose to Oregon. So it's Oregon, LSU. We had an all-SEC We had an all SEC Orange Bowl and an all-Big Ten Cotton Bowl. This is for a national championship. This is huge. If we can complete this, if we can beat Oregon, the video ends. That would be huge. Here we go. LSU Oregon, a chance at a national championship game. We're gonna we're gonna mess with the uniforms a little bit. We're gonna go white helmet, purple unis, gold pants. Here come the Tigers. Number nine LSU, number one Oregon. A shot at eternal glory. Let's do this shit, boys. Third and inches. We're in the red zone. Probably just gonna hand this off. Yeah, I got nervous. I shouldn't have handed it off. Oh, bad call. Bad read. I got nervous that all the RPOs were gonna get picked off. Oh, I did not want to do this. Jason Taylor, hold on. What? We didn't get a first down? Well, I fucked that drive up pretty bad. I'm just gonna be honest. Gonna bring some heat. Third and five. We get a stop here. That'd be huge. I'm gonna go back and sit on that safety. I'm gonna bring Major Burns down. Anything coming across the middle? <sighs> Good defense. Okay. We're gonna have to punt the ball. I think Daniels is gonna be open wide across the middle. I can, if my line can hold up. Excellent protection. Gonna put Holly on an out route. Hilton on a drag. Hold on to it. There we go. Five yards. Just got a piece away. We're gonna put the ball on the ground here. Haven't done it yet. See if we can hit him with a fake jet. Come back inside with an inside zone. There we go. There we go. That was a nice five yard run. Let's keep the ball on the ground. I didn't know. I wanted 55 to get up field, but he didn't. Four rushes for five yards is brutal. I'm actually going to put Daniels on a, no, I want to put Daniels on a slant and Thomas on an out here. And then Hilton on an out. I'm going to keep everything out. I, I, I mean, they're really giving me the out routes. That was a, I let him too far. Bad ball by me. I'm going to send Daniels on a streak. Hilton on an out here. Let's see if I can hit Thomas across the middle late. I don't know who that was. I forgot who that was. Hold on to it though. Oh, that was Samson. Good catch, Samson. I'm actually going to motion. Building inside. Okay, I see the coverage now. I'm gonna motion it back out. I like it now. Oh, wrong button! Oh my god! I meant to hit the underneath. Oh, I'm glad I let him off field. I'm gonna put Thomas on a corner. I f no, it's not gonna be the right route. I'm gonna put him on a post and Taylor on a corner. I don't like any of this. Oh, Mason Taylor's wide open, but I didn't see it until too late. I'm taking off with Garrett Nussmeyer. Taking off with Garrett Nussmeyer. Take off, Garrett Nussmeyer! Let's go! First and goal at the one. I'm gonna bring some major pressure. Get there. No, don't push him forward! I'm gonna put Lacey on a streak. Holly. On an out, Taylor on a slant. Right across the middle. Hold on, there we go, Mason Taylor. Huge catch. When I tell you my hands are literally like sweating, they have outside release. The inside's too crowded. Get there, get there, get there. Oh my God, I let him too much. I'm gonna put Holly on a corner. I think this is a touchdown. Right on the break. I didn't even lead him. I just pressed the button. I mean, these are incredibly hard routes to hit, but damn, we need him. I think Lacey's open on an out. Oh, they forced him inside. I gotta hit the drag. Cut up field. Excellent. I, yeah, I literally just had to get the ball out. CJ Daniels, nice catch. All right, let's put the ball on the ground. Let's see if we can hit it with a fake jet inside zone. I know the read man's right there. Not worried I don't hand this ball off. Well, they brought some heat. Damn. Eight rushes for 13 yards is brutal. Drag 
out for Daniels. I think Daniels is the read. No, he's not. Oh, they flatten that offensive lineman, though. I'm taking off. I'm taking off. Get out of the way. Give me a block. Give me a block! Garrett Nussmeyer on the ground! If you don't have a spy in this game, you're setting yourself up for failure. And we miss the extra point. It means we are currently down one on the out. Oh my god, I led him too far! Oh, I'm gonna send Lacey on a streak. Built the on and out. Just basic stuff. That crosser should be open late. That is not the crosser I want to hit. That was way off target. It's the literal national championship game. I'm bringing out the cheese. Jet touch pass. Going to the right. Cut up field. Give me that block. 28. Give me that block. There we go. Huge run. Pass. Whatever. They're giving us inside release. Hilton. I'm going to send Lacey on a streak. I think Hilton's open late. Oh my God. I'm missing all of these balls, bro. What the fuck? They're going to give me that flat. Taylor might be open. Nope. Hit the out. Get out of bounds. Third and five. I'm going to send Taylor on an out route here, actually. Oh my God. Go up and get that ball. Oh my goodness. What a catch. CJ Daniels. I'm out. They're in cover two. It means if I put Daniels on a speed out, Thomas, some of the, one of these, oh, way out of bounds. I'm not even leading him. I'm literally just tapping the button. Garrett Nussmeyer has been wildly inconsistent with these throws. Mason Taylor, what a grab! That's my final timeout. I can't take a sack. It either has to be a touchdown or it's got to be an incompletion. Shit, shit. I'm not going to get the ball off. I'm just snapping. I don't even know what the fucking play is. No! Yes! What a throw, Garrett Nussmeyer! Wow! Oh my god. I'm sweating. Holy shit! Third and five, a stop here probably keeps them out of field goal range, depending on where we're at. I'm on pen. Excellent! Fourth and five from the 30. That's a 56-yard field goal. There's no way they take that. We take you to the fourth quarter. I'm gonna put Lacey on a slant. They're in cover two. Taylor's my read. I don't have a read! Gary Nussmeyer! Oh my god, I thought it was third down. I took off. First and goal. A touchdown wins the game. Oh, I gotta run. Give me that block. Oh, I'm running way too much with Garrett Nussmeyer. Dude, my hands. Oh my god, my hands are so clammy. I'm putting green on a drag. I think the drag might be open super late. I got nothing. No, I don't. The drag was open! Let's go! We take a 12-point lead in the fourth quarter. Hit him with the Heisman. Oh! <sighs> They cut the lead to five. I think Thomas is going to be open on this. Yes, he is. I was late, but he's second and five. Just need to move the ball down the field. Oh, oh my God. I forgot it was a sick. I thought it was an out. We're going to take this to the two minute warning. We are first down away from winning a national championship. It's the national championship, baby. We got to bring up the cheese. Jet touch pass going to the left. Do not in man. Give me those blocks. Give me the blocks. Give me the blocks. It's a fun race. Cut back. Oh, -ho -ho! let's go. We are an onside kick return away from securing a national championship for LS, and we got it! Let's go! And that's gonna do it! The LSU Tigers are your national champions! I did not think we were gonna get this done in one year. Wow. We take down Oregon by eight. What a way to end the video. Grant Nussmeyer, player of the game, a great game. Almost 400 yards with six touchdowns. We needed every bit from Grant. Let's go. Take a look at the final bracket. Your 2024 champions, the LSU Tigers. I know I actually finished this pretty quickly with LSU, and then if you've seen my last video, I did Michigan. Michigan obviously is really good too. They ended up making it to the finals in this one. However, we had a winning record versus our rival. Pleaded goal number one. We didn't get to the top 10 recruiting class, so we're gonna call that not applicable. Didn't fail it. We didn't have a Heisman finalist. We did not have an SEC title. So even though we won a national championship, we didn't complete two of these goals, which means one of you guys gets a jersey. Make sure to leave a comment down below your Instagram and Twitter which jersey you want. And if I pick you, you gotta come with a nice little jersey. Thank you so much for watching. Like I said, leave a comment. Uh, comment which team you want me to rebuild next. Like, subscribe. YouTube thinks you're gonna like this video. Find out if they're right.